Hey friends and welcome back to my channel. This video is all about fixing the issue while launching the game Battlefield 6. You got a direct X function error, DXGI error, device removed. So without wasting time, let's go ahead and directly proceed with the resolution. First of all, in the basic step, go ahead, launch the game and open the graphics settings. Now right in the graphics settings, you need to turn on frame rate limiter and make sure you limit your FPS to 60 or maximum to 90. Do not exceed FPS to more than 90. Nextly is right in the display settings, you will find the option of full screen mode. Right over here, make sure you select the option as borderless and nextly is resolution should not be more than 1920 into 1080. After doing these two or three changes, save them and try to play the game to fix out the issue. If this will do work out, in next step, first of all, if you have not downloaded NVIDIA app, download it right from the official website of the NVIDIA. After downloading, launch the app and right in the global settings, you need to change two settings. First one is smooth motion. Turn off the smooth motion and second one is low latency mode. You need to turn it on. After doing these two changes, save them and again try to launch the game to fix out a direct error. If the game is still crashing, let's proceed with the next step. In next method, you need to open up the official website of the AMD or NVIDIA. From here, you need to update your GPU drivers. If you have an NVIDIA GPU, write in the search box, type in the name of your GPU and search for the relevant drivers. But the latest drivers may not be shown right over here. So I have another link of the AMD website itself. You can see the new drivers have support for Battlefield 6. So you need to scroll down and here is the link. Click on it. Download these drivers into a PC and then install them to fix out the issue. In case of NVIDIA, just open up the website and in the manual search, type in the details right over here and click on the option start search to find the relevant drivers for your GPU. Once the search is completed, you need to download WHQL recommended drivers by clicking on the option get download. Choose the option download now, download them and install them into your PC and hopefully this time the issue will be completely fixed. For AMD users, they need to change one more thing. They need to launch their AMD Adeline Edition control panel and right in the performance, you will find the option of maximum frequency. From here, make sure you do not exceed the maximum frequency more than 2700. Make sure it is below 2700. Then save the changes. Nextly is right into the BIOS menu, you will find the option of XMP profile or Expo which means you are overclocking your CPU or GPU. So right in the BIOS menu, make sure you disable the XMP profile or Expo or simply set it to automatic. After doing these three or four changes, try to launch the game and this time the direct X crashing error will be fixed. And if nothing works, the only hope you can do is to update your BIOS. You need to open up the motherboard manufacturer official website and from there, if there is any kind of BIOS update is available, make sure you update your BIOS to the latest version and this will resolve the issue. So that's all about it friends. If this video works out for you, I request you to please click on subscribe button and turn on the bell notification icon to continue receiving updates from my channel. Thank you so much friends. Thank you for watching.